everyone. I wanted to take some time to talk to you about the new Sims 4 expansion pack coming out in um, late July, the Horse Ranch expansion pack that's highly anticipated. If you are anything like me, you have used the Sims 3 Pets expansion pack and realized that the horses don't work on your computer and that's okay, but now there's a chance to really to really go above and beyond um, those limitations with The Sims 4. And with that in mind, I do think that, that the world's going to be all a big um, gameplay uh, world, as in Henford on Bagley and other worlds. In The Sims 4, and the reason I'm here is especially the Copperdale expansion pack with the high school there, I see something similar. Um, so I'm seeing what I'm anticipating, the new world to have, I'm anticipating it to have three aspects to it, three neighborhoods. I'm definitely thinking that the competition area is going to be in a neighborhood and then there's going to be an, a Wild West style or an Old West style town and then I'm also anticipating a national park style area that has riding trails. I would also love a secret world and then since we're getting horses the natural question then within the sims world or sims community is to see well is there going to be a unicorn aspect to any of the horses or are unicorns a part of the game? We were uh, told that there's going to be an ability to either befriend wild horses or adopt wild horses. Maybe I misheard, but that also sounds like what if you can befriend and adopt a unicorn. So we'll find out. And then the other part is that I see a lot of cross-pack compatibility. You can't ignore that. Um, I definitely see herding for um, cats and dogs it, with the addition of the goats and the sheep. I also see the recipes using some of the goat milk and I also see some of the uh, nifty knitting creations have some of the sheared wool um, from the sheep there. So. I definitely am looking forward to all the cross-pack compatibility. I definitely um, think that it's going to be a very strong pack, and I hope it's not very glitchy. That's what I'm hoping. I'm looking forward to trying some of the new gameplay. It sounds like there's a country line dancing um, skill or maybe capability there. I can't wait to try that. And all in all, it looks like a very solid pack. It does look like an extension of Cottage Living, but at the same time, it does look like it's complete enough to be a full pack that everyone can enjoy. So I'm definitely looking forward to it, and I can't wait to see if it lives up to the hype. Bye!